Natural environments and urban environments both provide a ton of opportunity to be inspired. I've been in Nashville almost three years. October, I'll, I'll hit the three year mark. Living in a fast paced environment, you know, just being in a city can actually be really energizing. Kind of feeds me and gets me through my week of craziness of, you know, working eight to five, working my side hustle, teaching yoga afterwards. And I guaranteed the reprieve of the weekend to just like slow things down a little bit. I love all the different cultures that you get exposed to, people that I wouldn't normally ever interact with. It just kind of opens your eyes to a lot of different ways of life. The effects of being in the city and kind of digging in is exciting. It's really good for the sake of just exposing myself to things that I'm not familiar with. But then like getting outside does like just as much good for me. It lights me up in a totally different way. Like one of those things where it feels really good to have something make you feel really small. It served me really well in terms of relationships with others because it's this really nice mirror for um, self-awareness of just like checking myself essentially, which then allows me to show up for the people that I'm in relationship with in a much, in a much better way. Is it something you crave for? Definitely. Uh, the great outdoors. In this city, it can almost like highlight all of the stuff you're facing in life. It's like compound that and make it a little bit stressful. Whereas getting out in nature and being in that spaciousness of the outdoors, I think just makes you realize, oh, but some of that shit just like doesn't matter. <laughs> which is really nice. It's like, you gotta kind of like turn the heat up a little bit, which the city does for me. But then at the same time, at the end of the day, it's like, you can also chill out a little bit.